Hey, welcome back everyone, Toysh is here, and I am back yet again for yet another World of Nintendo 2 video. And today I'm very excited because we're heading back to the world of Donkey Kong Country. Jack Specific is bringing us Donkey Kong and Diddy Kong, and I couldn't be more excited. Now, first and foremost, we have the lovable sidekick to old Donkey Kong, Diddy Kong. And this time around, he comes with a DK barrel, and if there was ever an accessory to come with a Kong... Well, they nailed it. You get to see everything straightforward right in that crystal clear packaging. And speaking of which, it's very simple, yet very effective. On the back side, you get all that World of Nintendo glory goodness with some yellows and some red, very befitting, of Donkey Kong Country. You get nice photos of Diddy Kong. And if you want to go ahead and screen grab this or just stop it, you can read up an old Diddy. Now, he does have 14 points of articulation. You can see his wave mate right there, Donkey Kong. And here's the barcode as well. They're starting to hit Walmart store shelves now. On the flip side, we got the big old Bananarama himself, Donkey Kong. And this time he is in the four inch scale. He comes with bananas, which is again, a perfect accessory for Donkey Kong. On the back side, you get the same old, same old, right? Nice crystal clear, nice write up, nice everything, nice photos. He's even doing a little thumbs up for you right there. And if you want to go ahead and screen grab this, you can read up on old Donkey Kong in all sorts of languages, right? 13 POA, he moves, he shakes, he dances. He does it all, right? Diddy Kong right there with his little barrel. And like I said, these are starting to hit Walmart store shelves now. And I hope you can find some. They're 10 bucks each. You can't beat that, right? But in the meantime, this is going to be an absolute barrel blast. Sit back, relax, grab yourself a nice hot cup of coffee. Maybe put a little banana creamer in there. This is a look at the brand new Jack Specific World and Nintendo 2 Walmart exclusive line, Donkey Kong and Diddy Kong. And while I got all you King K rules here, I just want to say thanks so much for always checking out my Nintendo videos. And if you haven't already, please do consider subscribing. We have old toys, we got new toys, we got daily news updates. Guarantee you'll find something here that you like. Like Toy Fair coverage coming up at the end of the week. So for Diddy Kong, you get the DK barrel. You know those barrels they throw, Donkey Kong pops out, Trixie Kong, Diddy Kong, the whole Kong family. I do wish that this broke apart. That would have been a nice little... Bonus upgrade, right? Maybe a little Donkey Kong, Diddy Kong inside. It's very hollow, it's very light. Got a little schmutz right there, right? On the DK logo, but overall, it is the perfect accessory for a Kong. Now, for Diddy Kong, for those wondering, this is the exact same figure that was released some years ago. I think it comes as quite a surprise to a lot of people. Jack Specific has been making Nintendo toys for literally years now. So I think when these come out, people go, oh, this is brand new. Well, yeah, it's updated packaging, everything else. It does have a little bit more crisper paint, if anything, than maybe, let's say, the prior released one. Same exact articulation. This is a pretty good Diddy Kong with the articulation, with the paint, with the giant accessory at the $10 price point. So no, I'm not going to complain that they didn't update anything. They gave us actually... For me, since I have the prior released one, I'm stoked on the barrel, if anything. But for those of you that, again, missed it the first time around, well, now you have your second chance at getting a really cool Diddy Kong action figure. And as far as new action figures go, well, for this Donkey Kong, we got a bunch of bananas right here, which, again, looks like the little icon piece for when you pick up a bunch of bananas in the Donkey Kong series donkey kong country all the old video games it's very simplistic but it's again perfect like the dk barrel however as far as donkey kong goes that's a brand new four inch action figure and one that i think is going to be a very welcome addition in a lot of nintendo jack specific toy collections right previously he was a little bit bigger more so maybe the older video games this one more in line with Donkey Kong, new video games, Super Smash Brothers, and the like. Children, parents, be careful of his cowlick right here. These are very sharp, so watch out for the small children on those ones. But overall, I'm very happy, especially with the tie. Now, right here, unfortunately, I got a little bit of a schmutz thing right there, but I kind of was able to rub it off, so it's a little bit of a, a paint uh, mishap, but it came right off, so I'm stoked. More so stoked that the tie... It is a rubber tie. It's not like the prior release giant Donkey Kong where the plastic makes me nervous. That's a perfect tie right there. Hangs and moves around. The articulation, again, I will say at the $10 price point, 
for the paint, for the sculpt, it's perfect for me. However, I do wish that around his hand right here where his fur meets, that could have been done a little bit better. It does sort of remind me of, let's say, N64 graphics in an odd way, right? I think a little bit more articulation in the elbows would have been great if they could spin at the elbow. See, it's right there at the shoulder, and then he has single-jointed elbows. If those would have been able to spin somehow, just added a little bit more articulation in the arms, that would have been awesome. But for the most part, in displayable purposes and everything else, yeah, that's Donkey Kong. Now, he doesn't have anything in the way of an ab crunch or a waist spin, but he's got plenty of leg articulation, knees. You can get them all the way out, but the way it's sculpted, he is in more of that hunched Donkey Kong position. You have some swivel at the feet as well. No peg holes. That's one thing. I think some peg holes uh, would be nice at the bottom for displayable purposes, right? Instead of having him going falling over. But for the most part... This guy is pretty stable. So through and through, it's a nice looking Donkey Kong. And if you were wondering, do they hold their accessories? Well, yes. Is it perfect? No, that's one thing I wish that Donkey Kong, maybe he had some articulated hands, something like that, the fingers, but did he look solid? And oddly enough, if you swap their accessories, that to me looks a whole heck of a lot better. So the DK barrel will fit nicely in Donkey Kong's hands right above his head, and that's how it will be displayed. And Diddy Kong can hold the bunch of bananas, so I totally dig that. Now, just to kind of show you, from the first release of Diddy Kong to now this new release, the new release is the one holding bananas. There's nothing new here. Again, like I'll say, maybe a little bit more crisp or paint if anything but the new accessory of the dk barrel is the ultimate new thing in terms of donkey kong now the prior release jack specific donkey kong was this more massive donkey kong figure which would kind of resound in the areas of early donkey kong games right super smash brothers maybe n64 era but as i'll say all day this new four inch donkey kong will be the more welcomed addition in terms of scale and everything else so very cool i'm actually happy to have both i see donkey kong in both terms but i like that they've updated the tie that's the tie technology is there now in terms of the scalature, so we've had all these World Nintendo, we got Super Mario movies, we got 2.5 inch figures, and yes, for the new Donkey Kong 4 inch figure, and as we've all known for a while, Diddy Kong, they will match up for the most part with all of the prior Jack specific releases. The Mario movie, no, those were always on the larger side anyways, but World Nintendo fans, you'll be a-okay. Now, I know people are going to ask, so I'm just going to do it anyways. Yes, this Donkey Kong, this Diddy Kong will go fine if you're a Sonic the Hedgehog Jack specific collector. <laughs> he will match up so you can Super Smash Brothers them all day. And again, I'm so happy that Jack specific is once again returning to the world of Nintendo, doing characters outside of the Mario landscape. And that being said, I would love a return to the Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. Please make those figures again, because I miss them. <laughs> so, that's going to do it for my early look at the brand new Jack Specific World of Nintendo 2 Walmart exclusive line, Donkey Kong and Diddy Kong. Again, Diddy Kong is a nice reissue. I love that they included the barrel, and I really like that now we have a 4-inch Donkey Kong. And, just to see in general... Donkey Kong getting a little bit of love. He's got a retread of a video game coming out. He was very popular in the Super Mario Brothers movie. I think more people want more Donkey Kong toys. Maybe even do a Cranky Kong, Trixie Kong. Hey, the Kong sky is the limit. But you've heard my thoughts, and now I'm curious to know yours. Comment below, let me know. Let's talk everything Donkey Kong. And I'm going to leave you guys with that. As always, drink some great coffee, eat some great food, but most importantly, remember which Nintendo characters would you like to see Jack Specific tackle next? And when they do, let me know what you found. I'll talk to you guys soon. Adios.